Hey boys and girls, Mr. Beard here. It's your class recap for Wednesday, February 29th. It's a leap year day, um, which doesn't come around a whole lot, so let's make it a good one. Our objectives today were to identify and construct parenthetical citations and to use technology to organize our research. We began uh, by getting out laptops, logging in. As we know, these laptops can sometimes be a, a bit of a pain and, and take a while to log in. So um, first thing we needed to grab laptops and start the login process as soon as the bell rang. The next thing we did was discuss parenthetical citation requirements. On Tuesday, we took notes over parenthetical citations and discussed what they are. Um, to put it quite simply, Parenthetical means it's in parentheses, and citation means you're giving credit to someone else's work. Um, and you can see here under um, our class website, we've got the PowerPoint from yesterday. Um, so some of the basics, I don't want to go into too much depth on those. If you have questions about that, please watch the video from Tuesday um, where we discuss this in a little more depth. But what st students needed to do was we're doing a module where, you know, we have this. Um, parenthetical citation PowerPoint up for students and then underneath that there are some questions where they had to go through identify strong parenthetical citation examples weak examples and um, some basic questions over some basic formatting issues and, and how to do that so today was on this short um, Wednesday remember that periods are much shorter on Wednesday so uh, we didn't have quite as much time, so the bulk of the time was spent on this module answering questions on parenthetical citations. If you weren't here and you have questions, uh, this is up on the website, and you may peruse at your own leisure. Um, and you, if you still have questions beyond that, of course, contact me, and I'd be happy to address them. So thanks for listening. That is our class recap for today. Have a good one.